I want to do a couple more examples here. I want to get some more practice with the midpoint rule. Um, we're going to estimate the integral from 1 to 2 of x times the natural log of x. Um, now, here b is 2, a is 1. So delta x, which is b minus a over n, is 2 minus 1 over 4, so that's 1 fourth. The midpoint rule says the integral is approximately equal to 1 fourth times f of the midpoints of these four intervals. So if we take the interval from 1 to 2, split it into four pieces, that's 1 and 1 fourth, 1 and 1 half, 1 and 3 fourths. Now we want the midpoints of those four intervals. The midpoint of the first one is 1 and 1 eighth. The midpoint of the second one between 1 and 1 fourth and 1 and 1 half is 1 and 3 eighths. The midpoint of the third one is 1 and 5 eighths. And the last one is 1 and 7 eighths. And that's 1 fourth. Now the function here we get from the integral, that's x log x. So that's 1 and 1 eighth, we want to plug that in there. 1 and 1 eighth is 1.125 times natural log of 1.125. And we plug each one of these values in there. Uh, I won't write them all down, but the last one here is 1 and 7 eighths. Plug that in and we get 1.875 times natural log of 1.875. And so that's an expression now that you could plug into your calculator. So you just take these numbers, these expressions, and plug them all into your calculator. And what you come up with is 0.634493. And so that tells us that our integral is approximately equal to 0.634493. Um, notice there that we never actually solved the integral as we would have using some of our earlier techniques in Calculus 2. We just picked different points and plugged them into the function and got an approximation of the area.